Philly Live Art Beat, the art and soul of the Philadelphia area. For two weekends in March, transport yourselves to a breathtaking realm of romance and enchantment in the Philadelphia Ballet Swan Lake. Swan Lake tells the forbidden love story of a prince who falls for a princess cursed by a sorcerer's evil spell. And starting tonight, the Philadelphia Ballet will be recreating the production using Tchaikovsky's powerful score. Um, the story is a, is a story of love and, and betrayal and something that, you know, in general, uh, we're all very familiar with. So I think that that's why people connect so well with it. But that wasn't always the case when Swan Lake first debuted in 1877. The score of Swan Lake, especially the first time that it was uh, performed, uh, it was a big flop people didn't really like it and it was not until later when uh, the choreography started to really come together with the music that people really appreciated the, the score of Tchaikovsky. Put your arm before you get into peaking. Anhel Correa has been the artistic director of the Philadelphia Ballet since 2014. I think that our Swan Lake has the best of all the Swan Lakes from around the world. And Anhel would know the cast will be dancing to his choreography. Talk about what it was like you know putting all the pieces of this puzzle together. Well, I was very lucky that I've danced one leg with many different companies around the world. So I sort of put together a version that it was going to be the most dynamic and the most uh, uh, easy to understand for our audiences. Paul Pujol dances the role of Prince Siegfried. It's his first time performing Swan Lake and having a principal role with the company. Dancing Siegfried is one of was one of my dreams. So I wasn't expecting to fulfill this dream so early in my career <laughs> so i'm just trying to make the most of the, this opportunity he dances alongside philadelphia ballet veteran mayara panero she plays princess aldette but i also have to play a swan but i also have to play evil swan so it is very complex and for a for a dancer a ballerina is is a is a very important role to play in her career There's many, many beautiful moments for me, but it's the end of the ballet where all the swans are on the stage, and I think it's the best music in the whole ballet. That's the part where the audience, sometimes they have tears in their eyes. What do you hope audiences walk away with when they come and they see this show? I think Swan Lake is the greatest introduction to uh, go back into the theater and fall in love back again with with uh, with ballet and uh, it's it's a ballet that uh, you know the, the music the the choreography the sets the costumes everything it feels so familiar and it feels it feels like you're part of um a fantasy world the philadelphia ballet swan lake runs march 3rd through the 13th for tickets and more information visit philadelphiaballet.org